this, this is not an easy game to play. And um, like it or not, it appears to me that this will not be effectively competitive with SCE, Southern California Edison, on either the percentage of renewables, and we want that as quickly as possible to get to 100 percent, or on the matter of competitive rates. So uh, I have grave doubts. I don't want to see any more Irvine investment until such time as we get Orange County Power Authority officials in here in front of this council. Now, I went back in the record on September 30th of 2021. I requested a presentation from the Orange County Power Authority. Now, I've been on this council since uh, December, late December of uh, 2020. And here we are almost a year later. And this request under the rule of two, I couldn't even get a presentation from the Orange County Power Authority. What am I left to do? I have to sort through papers and try to make my own appraisal as to whether or not this is an entity that we ought to be a part of, uh, or is it putting us at grave financial risk? Those $7.75 million came out of our asset management fund. Is that correct? You know, Council Member Egren, I don't know what account it came out of, but I can get that information for I you. I believe it's out of the asset management fund. That's a very important fund in this city. It's one of our reserve funds for maintenance and improvement of our infrastructure as well as for other purposes. The fund varied in its amount from 50 to $100 million, as I recall. And um, to see those dollars move from the asset management fund to this questionable power authority is uh, something that gives me uh, grave concern. Uh, therefore, I will not be voting. Uh, I will not be voting yes on this uh, matter. I instead will be voting no.